This is Emily Sample with another episode of Fermented Science. Today's topic, smoked meat. The culinary practice of smoking may be mm. almost as old as cooking with fire. No one knows exactly how smoking food was discovered, but history records Powhatan Native Americans taught the settlers of Jamestown, Virginia, the art of salting and smoking venison in 1608. The method of smoking adds mm. flavor and preserves foods like meat and fish by exposing it to low temperature smoke for prolonged periods of time, drying out the moisture that can allow bad bacteria to grow. You can smoke food hot in a smokehouse or kiln or at a low heat for as long as a day. I wonder how many times man got sick before learning this trick. So how does it work? When you hot smoke, the heat kills microbes and the chemicals found in the smoke act as a preservative. When smoking foods at lower temperatures, it's wise to use additional preservation methods like salt curing to make sure that the food is safe to eat. But most importantly, smoking mm. makes meat and fish smell and taste delicious. To learn more about preserving food, visit us at spoiltoperfection.com.